Hi, my name is Brian Rosner. I'm the principal of Ridley, Melbourne, and I also teach New Testament here at the college. As a young Christian, apart from the Gospels, which give us direct access to Jesus, 1 Corinthians was my favourite book in the New Testament. There we read of Paul's passion for the Gospel and his heart for a church which, let's face it, uh, was in a big mess. Divisions, lawsuits, prostitution, idolatry, arguments about spiritual gifts, doubts about the resurrection. I loved its raw energy and earthiness. Well, nothing has changed. I'm still gripped by the letter. As well as enjoying its more colourful elements, today I'm in awe of its profound theology and humbled by its keen relevance to our everyday lives. In the late 1980s, I did a PhD at the University of Cambridge on 1 Corinthians. And back in 2010, I published a commentary the size of a brick on 1 Corinthians with my good friend Roy Champer from Boston in the Pillar series edited by Don Carson. In 1 Corinthians, Paul models for us how to approach the complexity of Christian living with the resources of the Old Testament and the example and teaching of Jesus. In this Ridley Certificate elective, I put together a series of lessons that aim to equip you with the basic skills for interpreting 1 Corinthians for all it's worth. Together we mind the gap between our day in the first century of Corinth, reading the letter as a document from late antiquity. We stop and smell the roses, reading 1 Corinthians as literature, enjoying Paul at his persuasive best. And we begin to join the dots between our day and Paul's to see how the message of 1 Corinthians connects to our everyday lives today. There's plenty to keep you engaged as we look at everything from teaching about the church and spiritual gifts to sex, marriage and singleness. If there's one verse that sums up the whole letter, it's in chapter 16 where Paul says, do everything in love. If you want to know what love's got to do with it, I suggest you read 1 Corinthians and do this Ridley Certificate unit.